Well, it's always fun to open up one of these collection room boxes. This whole uh, box are little lugs and bits of pottery that were handles or lugs for ropes. And they were all found disassociated from uh, where they were deposited because this was part of what, when looters scoop stuff up, and this, we had school kids who would come out and we'd have them screen out all this material. Little eagle, little bird anyway. I don't know if that's an eagle. We're gonna lay these out, we'll look at these. These are fun. Well, there we go. Little horns, I suppose. Another tularosa, little animal head. Ah, a checkerboard, animal body. Very cool. Yeah, it is a centipede. He's got an antenna. There he is. Hey, centipede. Very cool. Uh, standard uh, cup. Doggy head. I love it. That's a beautiful one. That's painted on. Well, that's either a water dot or a centipede, maybe. Yeah. Should handle. Those little curly Q. Some, some sort of little symbol on that one. Oh, checkerboard again. Oh, this is probably a duck effigy, effigy, a bird effigy. Uh, I'd have to show you a whole one. In fact, I'll run and get it. I'll show you a whole one. Hold on here. A nice bird effigy, whole one. Little vessel. And I wanted to just show you that that's what this is. This is probably part of a bird effigy with the spiral. That's a nice one. A little for rope canteen, little animal. Little head. These black and white types are hard to date, uh, you know, just with little bits. You really need to see the little animal. Nice lightning bolt zigzag on the handle. Little triple interesting form. Checkerboard again. Another little animal head. It's fun as we spiral again. There's a little there you go. Ta da ha crap. Little collection of just spirals. Oh, a bird. We have another bird. We have both of those. Wait a minute, where's the other one? My God, we got both of those. Look at that. We have twins. We have twins. Same vessel. Uh, maybe. They have both the same one aware. Yeah, I'd say same vessel. Look at that. Son of a gun. A foot. Ha! Another doggy head. Probably to La Rosa, probably to La Rosa. That could be, that could be a lot of types. These black and whites are tight. There's another little doggy head. Another doggy head, very interesting one. I like that one. That might be a duck. We might be able to classify that as a duck. <laughs> uh, doggy head. Animal body. These are just made to pass a cord through. It's an interesting one. Hmm. Head. These are Southwest pottery lugs. They date from about AD 1000 through about 13, 1400. A lot of these are probably uh, canine, uh, little dogs maybe, coyotes. This one is probably a duck. A lot of little different animal forms, animal bodies. Now I brought up some vessels to show you what you know the handles are. Here's a little centipede handle. You can see the antenna and the head, and then it comes around. A mug, a little Mesa Verde mug with exactly a centipede on the handle. You see a lot of these um, canteen lugs. You see our twin birds here. These are cool. These are on either side of a jar, much like this. These little lugs on the side, that's what they're, it's all about. And here's your standard mug handles. I wanted to show you this. We saw this one little bird effigy, and here's a little bird effigy, part of a bird effigy. Little footprints, interesting. 
some of the wider handles. Here's a good little example of a uh, an animal effigy head or handle, and it goes on this really nice little uh, dipper. So, a whole collection of these.